Let's see how we can add a product to EasyPost. You go to Menu, Stock, Products. First of all, find the next available reference number from the existing list. If you don't have one, you can choose a preferred uh, sequence of numbers. But in my case, in, in the food list here, the next available number is 101131. So using these three buttons, Add, Delete and Save, I'm going to choose Add, make the fields empty and then on the reference I'm going to put 101131 tap on barcode if you have a barcode just replace that automatic number into your actual barcode and then on the name I put test product category in my example is an entree don't worry about attributes it's an advanced setup uh, tax standard is always uh, the case and then in my example I'm going to put $10 as a sale price uh, think a bit of electricity wages friend cost price of the product uh, I made the, the buy price as $3.20 minimum order quantity is the system generated pop-up message where it sees that particular number on your inventory count uh, pretty much order quantity reminder that you can have through the system Order in catalog is the number that you can have uh, onto an order item, like in uh, categories, that where you can rearrange uh, your products according to your preference. If you don't have one, the system will um, place the product alphabetically. Button label is a, a nice option that you can have if you have longer names, a longer name for the uh, for the product. You can have a shorter, clean name uh, as the as it displays on the button. Print the correct printer, have a tick here, and this is your kitchen order docker printer. Printer number two is my kitchen printer, and I'm going to choose accordingly and press save. Let's go and have a look how it's appearing on the sales screen. So it's on trace, and the test product is here. You press that, it's $10, and it's going into the kitchen. Um, so if you, if, you, if, if, if you find the product goes into the wrong kitchen, uh, wrong printer or wrong order docker printer, you simply go back into products go into entrees and refresh you get all the entrees here you have the test product here and then choose the correct printer from here so that you can uh, rectify that issue thank you